Okay, uh, thank you very much, uh, Karibudi Sana. Welcome to Uhuru Park, the new refurbished Uhuru Park. And uh, Karibu Sana, Bona Governor. We can all be seated now. What's a Shengia? Yes, so before I pass this microphone to, you know, for protocol uh, on the county side, I would like to understand and see, first of all, Waziri. Is Waziri seated? Silantoy and uh, Maureen, the people who are hosting us here today. Yes, Karibu. No. Yeah. So. Well, um, we're here for a very specific agenda. And uh, at the front, you can see we have uh, some people from the task force. And also, we have our partners who are partnering with us in this particular venture today. You'll get all the details uh, from our guest of honor, that is the governor. And uh, before um, I turn this into a church meeting, because you know, every time to go to a meeting here, uh, county, Lazma, Tuanze, Maombi. So I'll call someone, Susan, or anyone from uh, the county to just lead us in a uh, word of prayer. The, the other mic, please. To take off the Fadali, unless it's your official work. Microphone, please. Switch on the microphone, please. Thank you very much. Mighty and everlasting Father, the loving God, we come before you this afternoon. We want to thank you, Jehovah, Father, Lord God Almighty, because of the event, Lord God Almighty, that we are launching today. We thank you, Father, Lord, because of the Nairobi City Festival. Thank you, Father, Lord, for the vision that you have given our governor, Jehovah. We want to commit this festival before you, Jehovah God. How you, Jehovah God, for an event, Jehovah God, like no other, Lord. We welcome you, Jehovah God, as we big event ahead of us, O oh Lord. We welcome you, Jehovah God, even as we start. Take us through the entire process, O oh God. And even at the end of it, we shall be very careful to thank you and to lift your name. We give you praise. We give you glory. In Jesus' name we pray and we give thanks. Well, thank you. Chuck, Chuck, Chuck. Thank you very much. And uh, I'll take this opportunity now to just uh, directly introduce um, Maureen. Because, you know, technically we came here. And uh, this is her baby, this is her home, and she's the only one who can officially welcome us. She is now Waziri Environment, so please, Maureen, and then uh, you can proceed to introduce uh, Silantoy, and then we move forward. Good morning, all. Uh, indeed, today is a very good day. Today is a day that we are here at Uhuru Park, a park that had, was actually closed um, early, uh, late last year for innovation and, and retrofiction works. A park which is now going, going to be holding the Nairobi Festival, which is coming between the 12th that we are. Asante sana. Waziri Silantoi and uh, Maureen on your first day as uh, CECs. Thank you very much, uh, the members of the fourth estate for being here. Um, you guys are always great partners. Just please reduce that, it's too loud. You guys are great partners, um, and we always um, don't take for granted your work. You are what stands between us and the people of Kenya and Nairobi. So asante ni sana uh, for walking with us throughout this uh, journey. Um, I also am grateful to all our sponsors, our artists, our partners. Um, the Nairobi Festival is a chance for us to celebrate the core of who we are. But it's about a vibe, it's about a people, it's about a culture, it's about our positioning and what we sell um, to the world. So from the 12th to the 17th of December, and every year from this year, we are going to be coming together to showcase who we are, to celebrate our culture, and to have a good time as Nairobians. We're going to celebrate our ICT and innovation. Nairobi is the silicon savannah. It is the hotbed of innovation in the region. We're going to celebrate our performing arts, where we're going to feature upcoming artists, 
established artists. You can see some of them here, Joakali and the rest. We'll be featuring artworks, photography, and creative graffiti. I think you remember one of the first executive actions we took was to allow our photographers and filmmakers to take photos, uh, short films in the CBD before they used to be harassed. And if you come to the CBD on a Saturday or, or on a Sunday, you'll see amazing, amazing numbers of young people, Instagrammers, most creative matri, and transport circle. And even the ones which are the most organized and best behaved. We have a lot of traders who have already signed up who are going to come and showcase their wares and sell their product. It's an opportunity to do wholesome shopping from a variety of Nairobi businesses. And through our partners, uh, our media partners, uh, Media Max Limited and Coca-Cola, will be screening the World Cup games daily during the, the festival. So just as a brief background, on the 8th of November, I hosted a breakfast to ask for partnerships from various uh, organizations and stakeholders to help us realize this dream. And there's been a lot of overwhelming interest and support from the private sector, from NGOs, and different government agencies to collaborate in making this a success. And I also want to thank um, the national government and the president for the support in this uh, uh, process. This is a true testament of the economic potential of having an annual festival and the opportunities the Nairobi Festival presents in catalyzing the creative economy <clears throat> in our city. The creative economy is indeed an economic frontier that hasn't been tapped. And there are many people who think this is not a priority. I think they don't understand the potential that the creative economy has. In Nigeria, the creative economy is the second biggest employer after agriculture. We have talent in our country. We have what we need to showcase for our young people to engage. And that is why we're starting with this. And this is a priority, and we will do it every year. As a county government, we're very open and eager to partner with more in the private sector to help us make Nairobi work. I want to sincerely and very honestly thank our partners um, who came on board on such short notice. I think in less than uh, 30 days after we got into office, remember we were sworn in on the 25th of August, and many said, no, this it won't work. Do, do it next year. Don't do it this year. But we know what we are made of as Kenyans and as Nairobians. Not that we are last minute people, but we are very innovative. And we can get things on the ground quickly. I want to thank Safaricom. I want to thank EABL, Uber, the National Museums, Coke, Vivo Energy, Unilever, Witabix, Magnet Ventures, Farmbridge, MediaMax, Power Learning Project, Kenya Commercial Bank, AMS Group, IMG, NRG, G4S, Homeboys, and I hope I haven't left out any partner. Um, thank you so much for, 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 for partnering with us. We have a lot of artists. My friend from Nation was asking me who has confirmed. Nyuengi, Wakadinali, Juakali, Sujigeri Nengi, Wale Walimba Juya Subaru, Zamambaru, which I, I, I like and many more who you may not know. But I think during this festival, there'll be stars that will be born, that we'll be able to celebrate and to discover here. I would like also to thank um, the police, the Inspector General of Police, whom we are working very closely with. Security is, a, is, is definitely a concern of Kenyans. And uh, through the Nairobi Regional uh, Commander, we have beefed up security, both uniformed and non-uniformed officers, and not just here at the park during the festival, but all the way from the bus stops, all the way from uh, inside the CBD, the walkways, the path that people will use to come here, you will see security, both from the National Police Service, which is KPS and Administration Police, as well as our own uh, enforcement and inspectorate a security team from the county government. So don't try anything. Uh, anyone. Um, and we continue to put up these measures all across the city, uh, not just here. Uh, I'm sure you've seen that since we started our cooperation with the national police, the issues of muggings and uh, insecurity that are started in Nairobi have gone down. 
that partnership is being uh, strengthened. Many are asking why we're charging. We're charging 100 shillings for adults and 50 shillings for children per day. That is through our Nairobi Pay platform, star 647 hash. That is how we are going to collect the charges and people can, can, can prepay. This money is going to go to support our vulnerable in society through children homes and uh, old age homes as part of the county government's Christmas donation so that they can all celebrate Christmas. So I'd love you to have an opportunity to see this beautiful space that was done. This is our heritage. Both Uru Park and Central Park. Uru Park began as a dump site. Many don't know that. This was a dump site for the railway uh, service. Many, uh, how many years ago, Maureen? Many years ago. Uh, in the 50s, you know, thereabout. But the first president commissioned it, started works on it. President Moy also did his part. President uh, Mwai Kibaki promulgated the constitution here. We have Freedom Corner there, where we remember Wangari Madhai and our freedom heroes. President Uru Kenyatta did a lot of work on this park. And now President Ruto is going to take over from what his predecessors have done. So I also must acknowledge, because this is property of the county government, the former mayors and governors, who have also played a role in making Uru Park what it is. Many of us have stories of doing the boat rides, coming here on dates, or when we are tarmacking and we have nothing to do, Uru Park is going to be back. Central Park as well has a rich history. And I'd love if you had an opportunity to go and see we have a beautiful Nyatiti feature, which is going to be a wedding site for people to do that. We have an outdoor library. We have a skating rink. For those uh, young people who are always doing skating at sunken parking, now they have a world-class skating rink where they can you know, showcase their talent and, and learn. So I'll leave it there for now, Asanteni Sana. See you at the festival. And I'll take questions, if there are any questions um, from, uh, from the media. I think the brief was comprehensive. Yes, Ndugo. Using our, our local artists, a lot of what has been done here is through support from our sponsors. So I'll get the exact figures, but all of this is support from our partners who have been able to come on. So it is not that the county is wasting money, but we are taking advantage of support from, from various uh, partners. And that breakdown will be shared uh, for the public. Yes. Thank you very much, Bwana Governor. My name is Vincent Afanda. I work for Radio Citizen. Yes. I can see you have done a beautiful job. And my concern is, do you have any plans to revive Nairobi Dam, which is also going down? Thank you. Thank you for that question. Um, and, and I must acknowledge this work that has been done here has been done in close collaboration with the Kenya Defense Forces. Um, and even once we got in, I asked uh, the Commander-in-Chief for us to be able to have a continued relationship um, with them in certain aspects. And I'm glad that he, he allowed for that. Um, you've asked about Nairobi Dam. The only park that we have will not be Huru Park. Um, as a county government, we've budgeted um, to revive our parks, to do Kamkunji ground. Um, to, if you go to Roisambu on a Saturday at TRM outside the roundabout, you'll see families there. And there's no grass. People want these green spaces. And so we're going to develop many more green spaces, Jakaranda, Kamkunji, Calvary, in Eastlands, in the west of the city, to make sure that our, you know it, it's the, the, the environmental space, the built environment, and the natural environment actually, even therapeutically, is is, is very beneficial for for us and for our children. Um, I think you heard about the initiative that we have partnered with the national government, but both the president and I, on the Nairobi Rivers Commission. Um, the Nairobi Rivers Commission is going to address not just Nairobi River, but that is Nairobi River, Ngong River. Madare River, um, and Nairobi Dam is part of that. We've gazetted the names between the national government and the county government. We must you know, revive and replenish and have our rivers as really what they ought to be. You know, If you go around the world, riverfront properties and spaces are where people go to. But in Nairobi, it is where you run away from because it is stinking, it is smelling, there is sewage. If you overfly Nairobi, flying towards Makweni, you will see the river at some point is black, at another point, it is green. Billions have been spent on Thwake Dam, but what is going there is poison. 
So this process will, will also involve many stakeholders. We're going to widen the river. We're going to do commercial spaces, restaurants, so that you can have a proper riverfront um, and waterfront experience in Nairobi. So Nairobi Dam is part of it. You know it was supposed to be decommissioned, but that is part of the plan of the Nairobi Rivers Commission. And I thank the Deputy President as well for, for, for being focal in, in, in that endeavor. Tukosawa. Okay, my name is Cecilia Lubanga from Look Up TV. It's one thing to refurbish the place, but it's another thing to maintain. What are some of the measures that have been put, uh, put to place to ensure that once this place is open to the public, we are not going to see again it going down the it used to be? Thank you. The, the first measure that has been put in place is electing Sakaja as governor. That's the first measure. We have, we have a director of parks. We have an entire directorate and department. We are going to maintain this park. The small fee, you know, the 50 bob and 100 bob, is going to go into that maintenance after the festival because this one for the festival is for our children in children's homes um, and uh, old age homes. But we've budgeted for our parks. We're working with the KFS. I had people saying I'm, I'm bringing trees from Malaysia. There's no such thing. We're working with the Kenya Forest Services. Um, We're encouraging our young people to start tree nurseries. We're going to employ them not just to plant trees but to grow trees and to maintain them. So the park will be maintained definitely. We're also setting up a police uh, camp um, on the other side of Central Park, where we're going to have uh, close to 100 officers living on the park um, on the other side. If you, if you have time and take a tour, you'll be able to be shown where we're building that. So our security is maintained 24-7. Asante. Yes. Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum salam. Naito Mariam Mujahid kutoka Runinga K24. Ni kuna swali ngavuwa ningependa uudhi zungumzie ni kusiana na mstakabadi wako kusiana na vilabu kufungwa. Umesema Nairobi ni vaibu. Vaibu na shere ni watu na watu ni sisi. Ndiyo. Vilabu vitafungwa. Utabadidisha msimu wako kusiana na vilabu kufungwa saa katika msimu wa Christmas. Um, asante sana. Na hiyo nimesikia sasa vaibu. <laughs> Nairobi ni vaibu. Watu wa Nairobi wanapenda shere. <laughs> Lakini kila kitu hufanya na mpangilio. Vile tumesema hatuna shida na watu kuburudika hatuna shida na watu kuwa katika maeneo hayo lakini kelele kelele ndio shida ambayo tunayo tumekana hawa watu tumekana eh wanaitwaje the bar owners e, na ile association yao um, perak na balita sijui inaitwa ba, bakita tumekana hao na tuliwaambia hapo awali ya kwamba fanyeni biashara lakini muweke soundproofing Soundproof your establishments. Haizi kuwa watoto hawezi lala kwa sababu, ama watoto hawezi fanya homework kwa sababu wababa wana, <laughs> wana burudika. You, you don't have to make noise. And there are many of these establishments that have soundproofed and will allow them to, co uh, to continue. So, hapo awali, eh, tukiwa wachanga zaidi, wale ambao wanakumuka Nairobi, CBD na town do ilikuwa inashika na maeneo mengine ya Westlands na pia maeneo ya Upper Hill pale ambapo ni commercial we are going to bring back eh, hata Nairobi West pali, but sio ile unasema we are going to bring back life to the CBD and so we are actually going to incentivize those who are going to set up entertainment establishments and nightclubs kuna tofauti ya bar and restaurant na nightclub kama ni bar and restaurant endelea na kazi yako pale huko ambapo umepatiwa leseni Lakini ile disco ile ya bumtua fio, apana. That one we are, we are not going to, to change our minds. There are people who have had to go even to mental health institutions. Kwa sababu ya, unajua kosa usingizi sana. Unapata insomnia. We are actually losing out. We need order. And there will be order in this city. That one we have established, we must do. Nafikiri tunaza achia hapo. Kama tukosawa, asanti sana Shafi. And thank you for all the good work you are doing um, uh, with us in the county. God bless you. Asante. Na mwakisha mmekuja pia nyi wenyewe. Na wakaribisha directly kama governor wenu. Mje kwa Chuka. festival ya Nairobi. Asante. Tamasha. Festival, Tamasha. Same thing. Asante sana about the governor. And uh, just before we get the governor back uh, so that he can be able to take a uh, quick photo op with uh, all, the, all the partners and all the sponsors who are here. I uh, just want to recognize uh, the presence of uh, the NPS uh, who are here. As you can see, we are security, we are not taking it for chance. We have a whole full squad that's been led uh, by a team that is under security. 
and they are right here with us. And also, I just received a text from the Waziri, and this text has come from uh, the museum. And the museum say that um, uh, from the 17th all through, uh, sorry, from the 16th all through the 17th, all the two museums will be free of charge in support of the festival. So if you've never been to any of the, if you've never been to the National Museum, it will be open for you this uh, weekend, the coming weekend for the festival that is through the 16th to the 17th. Uh, Santeni Sana for the, you know that uh, particular support, and uh, yes, I think we mentioned all the sponsors. Uh, in case we missed to, uh, the governor missed to mention you, we recognize you, and we're going to have a beautiful, beautiful op with the governor. You know, that is the in thing right now. Everyone wants a photo with my governor. And yes, I'd like to also recognize uh, the, sub the people who are putting everything together, the two of the biggest uh, event managing companies in the country, and also the team behind it, led by Clemo, and definitely the Selantoy, the Sarah. Selantoy, before she was Waziri, Tulianza journey to cure Maraya, but now she's moved up a bit. And uh, Sarah here, who's the Moved Mountains. And who else uh, have I men mentioned? Yeah? Yes, the task force in general, from county, definitely sorry about that. Uh, Santini Sana, led by Julius. Our chair, our co-chair, who co-chairs co co the task force with uh, Clemo, is a lady by the name of um, Elizabeth. But she's out on assignment. She went to Nakuru. I don't know whether she's uh, gotten back. And also for Juakali for making time uh, to uh, grace the occasion. And uh, many people are asking the governor the number of artists. You see, that's not his job. He's given us a task, so I'm going to answer that question for you right now. We have over 50 uh, artists. I'm talking about the caliber of Jokali. People who have been in the industry uh, from 1990 to date who will be on stage, 50 of them. We have uh, about 40 uh, DJs. And uh, we have about 12 MCs. One of the MCs who will be there is a young MC. And uh, you, if you listen to Sound City, one of the radio stations that's, uh, you know, uh, causing a vibe in the city, it's uh, Jeremy Ohome, you can just wave, uh, who will be one of the hosts on stage. We also have Molim Rachel, that's uh, one of the hosts, not to mention we have Aziza, one of the youngest, coolest uh, radio and TV personalities, uh, who will also be on stage. So the numbers are crazy. And um, for the duration of the six days, it's going to be a party every single day. And we are running one of the biggest star search events. It's going to happen between the 13th through to the uh, 15th. That is being led by Talanta Mtani. And uh, we have partners from Safaricom and also uh, Roy, uh, Unilever who will be here and Coca-Cola who are going to help support that. So, kama uko umefunga kazi, ama kama una, you know, una, una wera your time, you can pass by here anytime. And another thing that has not been mentioned is we'll be charging. Yes. But do you know how much? Okay, thank you very much. Also, the other people who set up and are helping us with the setup, there is uh, Mike Rubber from Homeboys Entertainment, uh, who's with us. And uh, there's other guy who like, doesn't like to be seen. He's at uh, the back there. His name is Jay, and uh, he represents uh, Parrot Group. And also we have uh, Mulo, who's around here somewhere, still doing all this amazing stuff. So Karibuni Sana, for this uh, juncture, I'll take the opportunity to just ask the governor to come back and then we have a photo with the sponsors first. All the partners. Yes. As uh, the part of you, oh, one, oh, one by one, hey, moja moja. Governor, we want to a photo. And as, we, as the photos go continue, I'd like to recognize my very personal friend and uh, someone who we did campaigns with. He's now a Ziri in um, county, and it was Ben Molama, he's the Waziri of Talent. Brian, sorry, Brian Molama, who's the Waziri of Talent. Tafadali, salimi ya watu wana. Abari zenyu, asandeni. Yes, thank you. Okay, yeah, next, next, next. Please, guys, uh, let's, uh, uh, the guy is also a busy man. Uh, that is the team from Coca-Cola, Governor. Yes, they'll be giving us refreshments. So uh, actually, once we're done here, don't leave. We have refreshments that will be provided, courtesy of uh, Coca-Cola. And this gentleman is from Uber. Uber is one of our mob mobility partners, and they'll be giving discounts to everybody who will be using a taxi to come here. As you can see, the park, our, our parking situation is not uh, very at 100%. So we'd urge everybody to use, you know, the di oh, okay. <laughs> We're pleased to announce that Uber will provide, be providing a 30% discount for everybody coming to and from the festival to make this as affordable and as accessible as possible. 
So save a little bit on your transport to get here so you can spend a bit more and enjoy when you're here. Okay, let's, uh, um, uh, is that done? Please, that's the Uber team. Next team, please. Um, Unilever, Unilever. Let's go on and to pick on a Royco. Yes. And also, uh, there's a Shell, the team from Shell. Where is the team from Shell? Yes. The more Safaricom team. Safaricom, please, Safaricom. And uh, Sarah, I'd like to tell you that uh, Priscilla has given us exactly 10 minutes. <laughs> yes. That is a Safaricom team. Okay. Um, the, hold on, hold on. There's a... Are you done power? Power and then we'll do the... And then the, uh, I need the security team. I need the security team from NPS. The guys who are going to secure this place with full uniforms so that people can understand and see that we, mean, we don't mean uh, jokes. Chris Kirua, please. Arakisha. Yeah, let's start with NPS and then county. NPS and then county. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, Sawa, NPS. This is, the f this is the security team from Nairobi. And also, uh, just to mention, all the artists who are performing are Nairobi-based. We're giving priority to people from Nairobi. Yes. OK, uh, let's, let's uh, to Arakisha Kidogo. Please come this way. Or, yeah, yeah. So after this, I need the museum team to be ready. And then we'll close the photo ops with the uh, uh, Yes. Hold on. There's a, there's a team or a museum team first. Hold on. And then we f we'll finish with the task force. We'll finish with the task force. No problem. This is Nicole Tukonyumbani. Yes. Also, uh, this pack, there are people who welcomed us. And that is uh, Mitei LC. That is a lieutenant colonel who is in charge and the boss here. And uh, also definitely Njane, who is a project manager, who are part of the task force. So the task force will join after this, please. And we'll find out. We'll okay, Mite and the and uh, the team from Uru Park, please. The the people who welcomed us, hurry up, Maureen and uh, the gang. These are the guys who've been hosting us here. These are the guys who are doing the amazing job. Some of them are from uh, China Wuyi. CCs, all the CCs, all the new CCs who are here. Hurry up, please. Hey, Maureen, what are you mingi? Waziri wako wengi hawa tu ni wale the three of out of the seven the task force task force yote tafadhali